YouTube world. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Julie Jung and we're in Germany. Back in the kitchen. Woo, woo, woo. If you caught my last video, we tried lots of delightful meat products that I randomly chose from the supermarket and it was so fun. My taste buds were delighted, so delighted that I decided let's do more. So I went to the supermarket yesterday and I was looking, 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 and I found some very intriguing products that I think you will enjoy. Again, we are live taste testing here. I found some canned sausage products. Germany, as I believe, when I came here, I was excited about the sausage because everyone said, oh my gosh, German sausage is so delicious. And it is, it's very delicious, but I've only had it fresh. So now I'm going to try some canned varieties because convenience is important. And if you're on the go, you need a quick meal, gotta have a little something on the train or on the bus, you can grab a can of sausages and fix your problem. So, do I need to say anything? Subscribe, comment, I, all the things, right? I don't know, I'm really bad at this. I'm just gonna get right into it. So we're going to start with the first product, which is, whoa, look at that, beautiful. You can see why I chose this, looks delicious. And before, Starting this video, I just plugged these words right into Google Translate, and here's what I was told. This Bauernleberwurst mit Fleischbrüch is <clears throat> farmer's liverwurst with meatballs. Ooh, doesn't that sound delightful? So I don't know what this is gonna be. I really have no idea what I'm opening up here, but let's do it. Okay, that just, blurted everywhere. So we're, okay, it's pretty juicy now. Oh my God, oh. Look, oh, I, don't, I can't show you this without it coming out. Okay, I can't get in there. So this is supposed to be sausage with meatballs. I'm not seeing that with jelly. Well, uh, or is that? Potatoes? I don't know. I thought this was going to be like a sausage I could pull out and eat. It's not. So we'll just, okay, not just a little bit, just a little bit, just a little bit of that. Mm. That's pretty good. Actually, that is really good. This tastes like meatloaf or, mm, no, 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 no. It tastes like a beef stroganoff like a beef from the crock pot that you've been cooking for hours and hours and hours. That's actually, that, that's real good. That is really good. If I heated this up and put it on some bread with some carrots, celery, I would really dig that. Now this stuff, I'm not sure what that is. Let me just get a tiny, tiny taste. That's fat. That is just straight up that. This though, this is a winner. This is delicious and I would eat that. I would eat that. Reminds me of something from the States. There's a, a gravy type of thing in there too and that's just lovely. We've got a winner, people. This one is very good. Okay, there's just juice everywhere. There's juice everywhere and I don't have a towel. Number two is the Stadtwurst, Stadtwurst, and exactly translated it is, as opposed to the farmer's liverwurst, we are now going to sample the city sausage, the city variety sausage. I'm gonna put this down, because last time it splattered everywhere. Oh, it's scary. Mm. Okay, it's another ground up meat. I wonder if all of these are going to be ground up meat. There we go. Another little pate kind of thing. If only I had some bread. So the city sausage smells like cat food, but 
So did the other one, honestly, and it tasted really good. So here we go. Just gonna get a little, little teensy tighty. Mmm. Okay, yeah, that's also very, very good. That's very delicious. This just tastes like ground up sausage, honestly. That's all. I'm wondering how you eat this. See, just. Hear that? I mean, that's, that is solid. Germans, how are you eating this? You know, this reminds me of spam a little bit, like that. That boom, you hear that? Can you hear that? That's beautiful. So there's not as much gravy in there and there's not as much of that fat, but this one, I would also say, stuck to, to worst, is a winner. Not as good as the other one. The other one was more beefy tasting. Next we have the Met, Metwurst Gekocht im Jelly Mantel. Jelly Mantel, Jelly Mantel. And the direct translation for this is meat sausage in a jelly coat. Doesn't that sound cute? Sounds like the sausage is cold, so he needs a little coat. They put him in a little jelly coat. Brilliant. Open it up. I bet it's just gonna be a, like a block of meat again. Meat sausage in a jelly coat. Oh, yeah. It's the same thing. There's a hunk of meat, but this time we got more jelly in there. Can you see that? It's like a little jelly right there. So, I wonder if these are all actually the same exact sausages. They just have different names. This smells pretty good. I've had a lot of like meatloaf kind of things here in Germany and they're really good. They put them on bread, make a little sandwich. So I, I have no idea what kind of meat this is. I could be eating like cow testicles for all I know. Hmm, no. This one tastes a little more sausagey, but gosh, that's good. That is really good. That's really good. I think what you could do here is you could dig some of this out, make a meatball, fry it, put breadcrumbs on it, fry it, and then put it on some mashed potatoes. That would be really good. How about that jelly right there, this jelly? Oh, that, that's not gonna get on my fork. Mmm, 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 mmm. Tastes like bone broth jelly. That, again, winner. Winner, winner chicken dinner or winner, winner sausage dinner. That's very good, very good. We're doing phenomenally better than the last video. The last video was like, this is, I don't know how I'm eating this food. So already we're doing way better people. Next up we have some Blutwurst. Blut, Blutwurst. And the translation, I'm, ooh, I'm scared of this one. This is a blood sausage. I don't know what I'm getting into here. My husband would love this. He really likes blood sausage stuff, like the English breakfast variety. He loves that. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's. Hmm, okay, check it out. No idea what this is. This is some schwein speck pork. That's pork, but what's that color coming from? I don't know. And it's just so hard. That's very hard. Okay, I'm very brave. Do you realize how brave I am? I'm just going to the, the supermarket, randomly picking out things, trying them. Who else is doing that? I'm very brave. Mm. Oh my gosh. Again, winner. That's delicious. I don't know if I can describe that taste to you. It is like a liver block. That's like a block of liver right there. And it's very delicious. I'm not sure what the pink, what that, not pink, the white little specks are in there, but it's it's just like blood sausage, very delicious. I just like that consistency. Boingy, 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 boingy. 
I bet kids here love to play with this. So blood sausage, we got another winner, people. And the last one I picked up is a bratwurst hack in jelly mantle. We have that jelly coat again. This sausage is also very cold. So they created a little jelly coat and put the sausage inside the jelly coat. It's really nice. This is a, well, this is a bratwurst hack in a jelly coat. What is bratwurst hack? Somebody tell me, please. I don't know what it is. So, oh, I, I would also like to mention that the expiration date of this is 2021, right there, which is common for canned foods, but whenever a meat is good for about three, four years, I'm a bit skeptical. So, here we go. That, the first one really scared me because it just splattered everywhere. There's, there's juice all over my table. None of the others have done that, but this, oh gosh, they're so hard to open. That's another chunk of meat, folks. Got another chunk of ground up meat and it looks the same as the rest of them. They do all have slight color variations and the blood one is definitely much darker than the rest. Oh, this one's real hard. That one's really hard. That's solid. That's solid. The brick. I bet you it's going to be good. It's pork again. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. I'm digging. Ooh, that's good. This is really good. So all of these, I would suggest picking out the can. Get Scrape that fat out. But here's what you're going to use the fat for. You're going to scoop out some of this worst, some of any variety of these worst, you are going to scoop out and form little meatballs and then heat up that fat and fry the meatballs in the fat. And you are talking, we are, wow, we're doing well. This is very good. Mmm. These were all delightful. I would just like to say, Germany, these canned sausages are delicious. I don't know what brand this is. It has no, no real defining brand on it, but that's very delicious. So I just tried five canned meat products that I loved. And if you have any thoughts on them, or if there are any products, Germans, or people that have been to Germany that you think I should try, please comment below and let me know what I should try. And let me know if you have tried these products or if you know of other canned meats that you are just wild about that I need to try. So that's a wrap. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment below, like it, subscribe. Uh, you can follow me on Waffles and Whimsy on Instagram to follow my wild and crazy adventures in Germany, all the things. And I will see you next time. What will I be eating? I don't know. I don't know. Bye.